Hey everyone, uh, today, uh, it's been a while, I know, but I was setting up my new computer, um, which I will do a video later today on once I finish this epi last episode of Life is Strange. But I'll talk more about it after I get around the loud part of this. Previously on Life is Strange. I'm gonna skip it. Uh, y you know what happened. We all know what happened. Oh, we got shot in the fucking head. <laughs> made me sad, that really did. Hopefully it's not content. Bad content, you know what I mean. duct tape. Is anybody out there? Please, help! Doesn't she know if she's in the middle of anywhere? <laughs> help! Somebody help me! <sighs> Finally, I'm free. Almost. I hate looking at myself like that. You'll pay for this, Jefferson. I promised I would never go back in time like this again. But this is the only way. Slightly unconscious model is often the most open and honest. No vanity or posing, just pure expression. Oh Christ, look at that perfect face. Hold that stare there! Stay still! Shot. But please don't worry. We have all the time in the world. For now, I knew 
You were special the second I saw your first selfie. Yes, I still hate that word. But I love the purity of your own image. This actually caught me off guard. Not like Rachel, who I never was always suspected. looking in the wrong places. Poor Rachel. Wait. Let me try this angle. Not shot, not shot. Do it. Do it. Don't move! Oh. <sighs> Much better. Thanks, Max. If only Nathan could see this setup. He tried so hard. But you can't just throw a few subjects around and expect a cohesive style or theme. But he had an eye for shadows. And an eye for a whole lot more, as his elite family will find out, along with Arcadia Bay. Nice. Oh, good. Oh, those eyes. It's just too bad you're so goddamn nosy, Max. But this room is under 24-7 surveillance, so all I had to do was text you from Nathan's phone, and you fell right into my hands. You really should have focused on schoolwork, not private detecting there? with your little friend. Chloe. Chloe, right. Yeah, I'm sorry that I killed, that Nathan killed her in self-defense. But she had a troubled history like most Arcadia Bay dropouts. Nobody will be surprised, or care. Though I promise, people will care when you die tonight, Max. I wasn't lying when I said you have a gift. Okay. How's he know I have to rewind time? Now this looks good. <clears throat> Maybe a few more close-ups. Max? Please do not move so much. I need you posed and framed my way. Maybe a new dose will calm you oh, down. No, no. Now don't move, or this will hurt much. Stupid bitch! You just don't listen, do you? In fact, you never did hear much in my class. If you had, you might have seen all this coming. God damn, you are a fighter. It's been a long time since I played this. I've it's had my different. eye on you, and I've noticed that you've been more fearless this week than maybe your whole life. Remember my number one rule. Always take a shot. I'm definitely more awake in this photo. I could try this one. No. That picture isn't going to help. And I can't go through all that again. Whoa. I I'm definitely more awake in this photo. I could try this one. Wait. Jefferson couldn't handle stains on his photos. Good. Now I can use... I'd really like to smash that fancy camera, and this might work. Please work.
I really hate this mini game. Straight down, seriously. I've noticed your t shirt actually I'm changes. I'm getting some spectacular like images here, Max. Yes, Victoria would kill to be in your place, but she doesn't understand our See the connection. Right See. You're the winner, Max. I choose you. Your Earlier portrait. In the game, it was a Fuck you. Dear. You're trying too hard. I know you're scared. You all have the same doe-eyed look when you wake up here. Replaced by fear as you realize what's about to happen. Mr. Jefferson, why are you doing this? Oh, Max. I'm so glad you asked that question. As simply put, I'm obsessed with the idea of capturing that moment innocence evolves into corruption. That shift from black to white to gray and beyond. Most models are cynical. They lose that naivete. However, some Blackwell students carry their hope and optimism with them like an aura. And those lucky few become my models. My subjects. Yes. You're a psychopath. And this is your last session. Au contraire, Max. I'm so sane that nobody knows what's happening to you right now. As you can see, Sleeping Beauty here is too harsh for my gentle lens. And don't get me started on your late partner. I had enough of those faux punk sluts in my Seattle days. Go to hell. You will for everybody you've hurt. Unlike pure sweet Kate Marsh, I don't believe in that bullshit. She could have been my masterpiece. The world is what an artist makes it. And my muse... Blah, blah, blah. God, I hate your voice now. You might as well savor it, considering it's the last you'll hear. Oh. <laughs> that struck a nerve. Your face changed color. Beautiful. You will not get away with this. I want you to know that. Too bad you already made a convincing argument against Nathan in the principal's office. Thank you so much for setting him up for me. I do know that the Prescotts are going to have a major scandal when the town finds out what their elite son has been doing for homework. He's as sick as you. Don't judge people, Max. But that's why Nathan never should have been at Blackwell. That makes two of you. I hope Nathan realizes vision. So few people get that chance. You brainwashed him! I became a sort of father figure for Nathan. It's like Darth Vader. It happens often in teacher-student relationships. It was kind of touching for a while. Did you tell him everything about your plans at Blackwell? Don't be stupid, Max. I told him what he needed to hear. In return, I had access to the Prescott fortune. Who do you think paid for this glorious dark room and equipment? How else could I get all these hip new drugs for my subjects? Rachel Amber was your victim, not your subject. Oh. That's up for Rachel a subjective Amber. debate. Hmm. That's what? the real tragedy. I don't know. I'm trying to make puns. Nathan thought he could be an artist like me. Instead, the dumbass gave her an overdose. Chloe and Rachel. You killed both of them. They're fucking together in heaven right now. Is that what you want to hear? Why? 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 Start listening to me, you dumb cunt. Jesus Christ. I'm sorry, Max. <laughs> that was not cool. Anyway, Rachel is dead. But no tears. Los Angeles would have killed her anyway, so look at this as a favor. You're evil. Oh, I see. You and your friends almost beat Nathan to death. See, we're not so different. Yes, yes we are. I cared more about Nathan than you did. No, you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic what I do with the camera and subject, like father, but not like son. 
Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. Do you finally get it now, oh, Max? I can't compromise shit, my vision with amateurs. You are an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. Can I kill you can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't kill, care kill. what you do to me. You're gonna die, oh, yeah, motherfucker. For Chloe and Rachel and everybody else. I do love your spirit, Max, but you brought yourself here. By your own choice. Anyway, I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. Okay. Okay. Now, let's see how these shot rules came out. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your work out. Alone with a heart, a battered old heart, a heart that needs tender Sorry. I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. Okay. Wait! Please, Mr. Jefferson. Max, I would love to talk shop, but I really need to go over these pictures. Especially while they're fresh in my mind. I think our session was a career high for me. You... you still have my diary. Don't worry. Nobody's going to read it. Thanks for reminding me. There's nothing more innocent than a teenager's diary. Oh, look at your selfies. What a waste of talent. Look at that shot, Max. You can do so much better. <laughs> Thanks. That's my ticket out of here. I just gotta kill him. With a heart. Oh my god. I could go all the way back to the moment this all started. Max, this could be your chance to fix everything. For good. you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb I'm word back. for a wonderful photographic trick. Right back where I started Max. this insane That's week. Good. And nobody course, is going to hurt Chloe know, ever again. The portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was Sorry. not the first so to get, use images for him. selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, <laughs> since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? The Daguerrean process. Oh, well. That was easy, Max. Was it? Okay. Well, uh, okay then. So, uh, the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear, defined features. Figure out how to take you can out. learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned can chapters. I actually kill him? That'd be cool. Obviously, Max has read them. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday time Heroes to change time. The winter to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the First, let's, let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. And Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Bastard. I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. Even if you're submitting your photo to the 
I should be able to track down David's number from the school. Found you. Um, five, 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 six, thirty, eight, two, four, three. Remember that? For once, David, I don't need I'm remember. praying you'll overreact to this as much as everything else and take Jefferson down fast. You wanted me to enter the contest, asshole. So maybe I'll be going to San Francisco. And Jefferson, you'll be going to prison. The past within the past. Am I pushing myself too hard? It doesn't, I'm happy to fix it, so you'll be here to get your fancy camera, Victoria. Hi, Kate. Oh, hey, Max. Kate, listen to me. I am. Always remember that you're not alone. I've got your back no matter what happens. So do a lot of other people. We all care. We're all here for you. You need to know that. Max, that makes me feel so blessed for the first time this week. I, I don't know what to say. That's okay. Neither do I. Maybe we could both use a hug. And that stopped her from Thanks. committing suicide. You always know the right thing to do. This one room, I gotta change so much stuff. This is the last time somebody bullies you, Kate. Oh, Rachel. I'm sorry. Is there anything else I can change? I can't blame the cameras, but I just think of Jefferson using them. Not impressed anymore. What else is there to change? Is she crying? Her eyes are pretty red. I wish she was crying. All I hear is children crying in the background. I'd like to bust this up right now. I still feel like the lighthouse is calling out to me. Mr. Jefferson, we need to talk. Uh, Can you see I'm talking to Mr. Jefferson now? Yes, I see. But maybe you shouldn't. Uh, and why not? Hold on, Victoria. Are you okay, Max? I will be when Victoria understands that hiding behind a screen, posting videos of people is incredibly cruel and unfair. You're smart enough to know how easy it is to hurt somebody, to destroy their life. I just want you to think about how much it would hurt if somebody did that to you. Yeah, if I try to leave You the can room. always make the right choice, Victoria. It'll end them. I know you've got a good heart. Pass. I've seen it. Listen, I... I didn't... You don't have to explain. There's no reason for you to be so insecure that you can't be happy with your own talent. Wouldn't it be better to lift people up than to bring them down? You could inspire people. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about now, do I, Mr. Jefferson? I think I should stay out of this one, Victoria. Then I guess I'm done talking. And that's okay, too. Oh! That was kind of random, Max. What did you mean? Here's my photograph for the Everyday Heroes contest. Oh, uh... That was easy. No. It wasn't easy at all. Well, I, uh... Everyone's so fucking I, I can't prejudge yet, but I'm very happy you decided to enter. That means a lot to me. And Blackwell, the, the first step for any artist is to put themselves out there in the world without fear. 
to be innocent. Or guilty. Ah. Well, and thanks for the photo, and maybe both of us will be jet-setting to San Francisco this Friday. Or maybe only one of us will be going. Don't be so modest, Max. Anything can happen in a week. As you're going to find out, Mr. Jefferson. It's like, um, I'm so confused. I did everything right this time. Good work, David. to be in between realities. Everything is out of focus and in the distance. I still have my power. Nope. Let's see, 10 across six letters. Aw, I haven't seen Hot Dog Man in forever. Chloe and I used to totally play the video game and watch him all the time <laughs> when we were innocent. But now we're guilty. I have to admit, I love being called an artist. Excuse me, sir. Can your phone has to be shut off. We're almost in San Francisco. I'm so stressed, but I'm so excited too. Please. It's the beginning of the end for Jefferson and the Prescotts. Shut off your phone. Please fasten your seat and stow any electronic gear until the plane is on the ground and at the gate. Thank you. We're starting our descent in a few minutes. It's a beautiful day in San Francisco with clear skies and cool 60 degrees. We hope you enjoyed your trip and we thank you very much for choosing Pacific West Air. Come fly with us anytime. Uh, I don't think so. I'm hoping these airline seats get... I'm so excited to. How did you sleep? Hope I wasn't snoring out loud, Max. Just a bit. It's been a tough week at Blackwell. So I hope you'll forgive me. Between Mr. Jefferson and the Prescotts, things have been hectic, to say the least. I totally get it, Principal Wells. That's a smart way of telling me to stop whining. We are proud of you for representing Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes Contest. I know I'm not exactly the guy you wanted in San Francisco, but 
We all want you to have a great experience here. I already am, and we're not even there. Oh, Christ. Another nosebleed? Max, you're not just screwing around with time. I noticed that there is a karma system in this game um, with your t-shirt. Uh, well, not right now, as it's towards the end of the game. San Francisco is so cool. But your t-shirt And this changes, gallery is huge. Depending on uh, So is the buffet. Actions. If an event skimps on the food, you know it's a bad event. As long as I don't have to eat any caviar. This is your day, Max. You can do whatever you want. I hope you take advantage of your status and talk to as many influential people here as possible. What? Work the room. I don't know. I, I feel so weird, like I'm a little kid hanging with the adults. Max, after this week, you are certainly not a little kid anymore. In fact, you're a noteworthy adult being honored by your peers. Now you have to start acting like the photographer you want to be. Hell, I wanted to be in charge of a big school someday. So I started taking charge of things when I was young. <laughs> Ask my poor classmates. Max, I'm gonna eat up that caviar so you don't have to. Uh, better get in there and start schmoozing. You know, I won't always be here to take charge. But you come talk to me whenever you want. Come on, Max. After everything that's happened, this should be the least scary thing you've ever done. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? So many wow, sir, Max. Die. You did it. Somehow, I went from the dark room to this gallery. I've been through so... There I am, along with all the other winners. I should say artists instead. I don't say it. Oh, there it is. I heard Mark Jefferson was supposed to be here tonight. Anymore. That was so not my shocking. style, but the neon is a nice representation. Oh shit! Pretentious alert. Are you Max Caulfield? Bravo on your entry. I'm the art critic for Iris. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. How do these galleries afford to rent here? This makes me feel so sad. Like I was back... Uh, usually these kind of contests, they uh, they put me to sleep, but I like that how they show me about... exposure. Me too. Where's my picture? Go buy an instant camera. Damn, I bet that film costs a fortune. Hi, and there she is to save the day. Hi. How did that win, anyways? I mean, it you is a nice it, Max. Picture, but... You're a real artist. At least, for today. What am I gonna do? I'm gonna start getting a poster of every game I beat. Okay, we lost uh, you there for a second. Your nose. I'm okay. Uh, jet lag, high altitude. Oh 
Oh, you left the ringer off, idiot. Oh, come on. Please answer. What? Oh no. Chloe, where are you? I'm so fucking scared. I'm, I'm by the beach. I'm Chloe! Stuck. Can you hear me? Hello? Hello? It's like I think you decided to take that trip, right? <laughs> oh my god. The tornado was real. Oh, I didn't fix shit. Chloe will die. Arcadia Bay is gonna be destroyed. There has to be a way to stop this. For good. Look at this print. The depth of field, the colors. Medium format camera using a Leica 35mm lens. Black, I do not understand art. How much would you pay for that? No fucking way. Chloe can't die again. I have to save her. I didn't even take a picture like that. doing the time I just have to make one simple change so I won't end up in San Francisco simple sorry San Francisco Chloe comes first why did she choose to go to San Francisco in the first place Wait, what? He didn't go to jail? Oh, fuck! God, no! I'm back here again? I thought I fixed everything! What did you say, Max? What? Jefferson should be in jail, not here. Jesus. It's like you're back in my class. You're still spacing out. It might be cool if you took one of your patented selfies now. The transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway, answer my question, please. Eat shit and die. Good answer. Good answer. It's delicious. Hey, your nose is bleeding. Probably gave you too big a dose. Sorry about that, Max. But considering you're about to die, a nosebleed is a first world problem. Oh. I had to let Victoria Chase go. You let her? Don't be stupid, okay? She's exactly where she deserves to be. No. Oh. As if you care. I'm a pacifist, damn it. Your iris, that dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now. Too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest, but you destroyed your own beautiful photograph. What a waste. Sorry, I burned all your stuff. I got a little carried away. Fuck. He burned my diary. That's why I'm still here. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero within a week. There's something... weird going on with you. Whoa. Did you see how crazy it is outside? Like 
I said. Something weird. There's that fear. Oh, Max. Kick him the balls. It's an Do honor it. working with no. you on these final sessions. I hope these images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. The loss of youth. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. Please, don't do this. This final dose won't hurt. What? I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Wait, hold on. Can I, can I please ask you for one last request? Oh, you got me, Max. How can I deny that face? Could he please at least play some music so I can drift away? Even at the end, you're still a dreamer, Max. Thanks. It's a nice trait. Now I'm a little bit crazy. Out of my mind. I'm always like, please, straight to the head. It's all a little bit hazy. But I'm pretty sure. Gonna stay screwy instead. And I'm a little bit cuckoo. Gackers. Hold it! What? He'll just knock me out. I mean, he doesn't have a weapon. He has a syringe. What can and he I do promise this? you. Uh, excuse me, but my, my throat is scratchy. Can I please have some water? Of course. I don't want you to be uncomfortable. Makes him take more time. I promise. This final dose won't hurt. What? David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? Would you uh, take one last picture of me? I I want to be your best subject. I almost don't believe that, but I think you've finally learned from me. That's cool. 
It's all burned. Yeah, of course I can't check my phone. I promise. This final dose won't hurt. What? David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? Stop, stop, stop. No, oh, whatever. How am I supposed to do this? When I pr And would you mind turning off the lights? They make me squint, so I won't look good for the shot. Now, you're thinking like a real photographer. And I don't want your last memory to be bad lighting. This final dose won't hurt. What? David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? David, watch out! How? How did you know that? Jesus. David Madsen. He's out cold. Good. I always hated that fascist fuck. Everybody at Blackwell did, right, Max? Okay. How the fuck do I do this? So it's not the light option, because that's just not working out. When I pro what do I promise this final dose won't hurt. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. What? Going to stop me? Grab your gun now. Got it. Sorry, Madsen. You should have stopped. Sorry, Madsen. 
You should have stuck to harassing students. Okay. <laughs> This is hard. What? Going to stop? Grab your gun now! Oh. oh, Christ! David Madsen, you are one stupid son of a bitch. So don't blame me. He reminds me of the Joker. He's kind of funny. What? What? Going Grab to stop? Grab your gun now! What? Going to Nathan, stop me? Kick that table! Yes, sir! <clears throat> David Madsen! <laughs> Going to stop me! There we go. A lot of quick time events. Well, they're, they're, they're technically oh, Lord, quick time. Max, are you okay? Are you all right? Can you move? Yes. Thank you, David. Thank you. No, thank me. You brought me here. Let's wrap up this son of a bitch first. <gasps> he won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. Except you are going to prison forever. Or worse. Mr. Jefferson, now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Save Chloe. He burned everything, including all of my photos. Warren, yes, I, I can use that picture he took of us. No signal. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. But you won't need this anymore. Grab some soda, man. The Prescott's had to Jefferson know Jefferson looks so... pathetic now. David? Are you okay? I have no Look idea how this long place. it's been it feels like hell. Jefferson was... was going to kill me. Like he did to Victoria Chase. Oh, no. I always suspected that son of a bitch. I never did. Until too late. You shouldn't have to suspect your teacher. He wasn't a real teacher. He just wanted to lecture. It was part of his sick plans. I wasn't surprised when you accused Nathan of drugging Kate Marsh. I thought so too. And Max, I treated Kate like shit. I know she's a good person, but I'm not. I hope I get to tell her that soon. Me too. I think that would make her very happy. I knew Nathan Prescott was a threat. I just waited too long to neutralize him. Jefferson already did. They had some weird father-son thing going on. But Nathan hey, killed it. Rachel, and Jefferson had to use him as a scapegoat. That pervert was pulling all this shit right under my nose, too. I could have stopped him and Nathan if only... I wasn't so stupid. No, I, I should have told Principal Wells Nathan had a gun and, and almost used it. I put the school in danger. We all make decisions we regret. But I have to admit, I'm impressed by you. And Chloe. And your investigation. I had all the high-tech toys while you had each other. We... We are a great team. That's one of my problems. I'm not good at teamwork. Never was. Yeah, that explains why you died 17 service. times. I can't even imagine what you went through. I'm not gonna make any excuses for my you behavior. Say something, you're like, got it! <laughs> I tried to be a good soldier, but... Thanks for the warning. I wasn't so great. I tried to be a good father, too, but... Give me throw a fucking bottle. When Joyce kicked me out... 
I had nothing. I'm so sorry about that. I didn't want that to happen. I should never have set up those surveillance cams. We kept all those files. I'm going to tell Joyce I was wrong about you. She does love you. It's pretty obvious. I try not to use my service as an excuse, but it's hard to come home after war. Most people don't know or care what it's like, except Joyce. She gave me hope, a new life. And you saved mine. Chloe, is she, she would be proud of you. I just want to see her safe with her mother. I promised Joyce I would go see a family counselor. Uh, I'll start by apologizing to Chloe. I don't expect her to call me dad, but maybe she'll stop calling me step douche. So where is Chloe? David, uh, Chloe is, is dead. This isn't happening. It can't. No, God. Not Chloe. Max, are you are you sure? Are you? Yes, I. I saw her. I. I saw. A, Jefferson Killer in the junkyard. Last night. Last night? When I was feeling sorry for myself in my hotel room? I promised Joyce that I would protect her and Chloe. How can I face her and explain this? I never even told Chloe that I... I God damn it! You killed my wife's child, you sick fucker! And you took away my stepdaughter! David, wait! Yay! I just wanted that to happen. Ended on a sad, positive note. Max. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to see that. That was. I, I wish I could have seen it. That was beautiful. What a mess. What have I done? All Don't that know. time I wasted with surveillance. I, Chloe. I'm sorry. Joyce. I failed you. My family. Is he gonna shoot himself? You didn't fail. You did your best. Max, you better get outside. You've seen enough of this room. I've seen David. Pasta. Thank you for saving me. Technically, she saved herself. Because that fucker doesn't know how to throw a bottle or get a gun. Or kick a table. Yeah. <laughs>